Is your coffee on? Thanks. Did you hear about the shooting? Uh, yeah, I saw that. I don't know about you, but these things are scaring me. Criminals dying in jails and cure followers are going crazy. Uh huh. You know what the scary part is? Cure followers are dying too. Of course they are. I mean, they're twisting the image and philosophy of Kira. What? what? I mean, it's really not surprising when you think about it. People tend to twist the messages of the divine to fit their own agenda. I mean, these attacks are really no different from the Crusades, the Spanish Inquisition, the killing of natives in America. I mean, no god would allow such horrendous actions. What are you talking about? Kira followers are murderers and terrorists. Kira is justice and a martyr who tried creating a better world for us to live in. Kira is not justice. Justice is not something that can be defined or controlled by one man. Not to mention that he killed thousands of people, including members of the Japanese police force and the FBI. Murder is not justice. And explain to me something. Why do we fight wars, hmm? I mean, both sides murdering each other, and for what? The greater good? For peace? Dying for a piece of cloth? And what about our political system? Corrupted, broken, filled with hatred and greed. Under Kira, violent crimes dropped drastically. Armed combat halted. The world became a better place for us to live in. You're not. Don't tell me you're. I screwed up. I better fix this quick. I don't understand, Alicia. Why is it a problem if she knows you follow Kira? And get arrested and probably executed? I can't allow that to happen. How else would I continue the will of our Lord Kira if that were to happen? You are a strange human being, Alicia Adams. Your conviction is something to admire. Azrael, I'm trying to concentrate. Madeline Myers, suicide. After the shock of realizing her friend is a Kira supporter, she realizes how she was wrong about Kira and decides to hang herself in an attempt for forgiveness. She writes a note that reads, Our Lord has returned, before she hangs herself with a leather belt. Instead of letting the belt snap her neck, she dies slowly suffocated, clawing at her neck in a desperate last minute attempt to save herself. What is it, Lilith? I see. There's another user of the notebook. You are very diligent on writing on that notebook. I am diligent because it is my duty. I am diligent because the world is rotten, infested with corrupted, selfish, self-centered, bloodthirsty filth in the shape of humans. <laughs> They seem to possess the eyes of death as well. Take a look around, Azrael. This infestation must be cleansed to save the innocent. There is no god, Azrael. No god would allow all these horrible things to happen. Kira took it upon himself to cleanse this hopeless world of sinners and injustices. <laughs> Kira? Therefore, in his absence, 
is my duty to carry out his will. Is this supposed to be God? Very well. Come on. Face me. 